Hi everyone, I'm Janine Zanoni, aka Gigi, Developer Advocate and Product Manager for the Tableau Viz LWC. My personal mission is to help admins and developers to extend and integrate Tableau in various ways using our APIs and developer tools. Today's demo is about the new Tableau Viz LWC. We are enabling any Salesforce admins or developers to quickly integrate Tableau dashboards right into Salesforce pages. Tableau provides business intelligence software that helps people see and understand the data. We help people and organizations become more data-driven. Our customers are not only data analysts, but include business users in sales, marketing, human resources, really anyone who wants to connect and combine data sources. And we want you to be able to embed Tableau anywhere. In the past few months, we have been working on an easier way to embed Tableau inside Salesforce. And today, we are proud to announce the beta of the Tableau Viz Lighting Web Components. The Tableau Viz AWC is a new tool for Salesforce developer who wants to embed Tableau inside Salesforce. In this demo, I will show the Tableau Viz AWC and highlight three key features. Customization of the look and feel, context filtering on the page, and advanced filtering that lets you define your own filters. Let's dig in. As a Tableau user, I have multiple dashboards available on Tableau, the sharing and collaboration platform. I'm interested in this particular dashboard that is showing my LinkedIn activity for myself and my team members. I blended this data with data coming from Salesforce so I can better understand if there's any correlation between my Salesforce activity and myself. Ideally, I would like both myself and my team members to access it on Salesforce, so they can take actions from inside found on the dashboards directly inside Salesforce. I can ask my Salesforce admin to embed this viz inside Salesforce. So I'm not anymore GG the Tableau user, but GG the Salesforce admin. I want to embed this viz on the home page, so all the members of the team can access it once they sign in to Salesforce. Go ahead and edit the page here. The, lighting, the Tableau Viz Lighting Web Component is already under Custom Manage because I already installed the Manage package. Go ahead and drag and drop the Lighting Web Component. The Tableau Viz Lighting Web Component is going to show a Tableau Public Viz to show that things are working as expected. But I don't want a Viz from Tableau Public, I want a Viz from my Salesforce, my Tableau environment. So I'm going to go there and get the link of my Viz. I'm going to paste it in the Lighting Web Component. And straight away, I can see my visualizations. I can also customize the look and feel, like showing the toolbar, for example. I can see the toolbar. I can hide it again. I can also edit the height of the viz itself. Once I'm done, I can go ahead and save my work. Now, in a few clicks, I was able to embed Tableau inside Salesforce. I can now see my viz and interact with it. Another option is to embed it on the user page, that's the record page. Again, I'm going to go ahead and drag and drop the lighting web component there. I already have the URL of my viz. This time, because I'm on the record page, I have more options for filtering, as you can see here. I'm going to use the in-context filtering. Check the box. What it's going to do is it's going to filter the viz based on the user you are looking at. Right now, we are looking at my page, Geraldine Zanoli. So you can see that the viz has been filtered for only my data. Everyone accessing the user page is now going to see the data they only care about for the user they are looking at. So now we see data only for Geraldine, as we are on Geraldine page. 
Another option is to have this viz on the icon page, so the salesperson can see his LinkedIn activity directly when he's looking at his accounts. So here, I already have a Lighting Web Component drag and drop, but I cannot use the in-context filtering because we are looking at the account page and the viz doesn't have the details for the account. But we want to filter down for the account owners, so who is owning the account. So you can see its own data. So I'm going to go ahead and use the advanced filtering. I'm mapping the data from Tableau to Salesforce. So on Tableau side, user ID, and on the tab on the Salesforce side this time, we are going to look at the account and the owner ID. Perfect. So now you can see that the data has been found for the account by this Geraldine Zanoli. In this demo, we looked at the feature of a Tableau Viz LWC. First, we saw how we can customize the look and the feel of the Viz. Then we use the context filtering to filter Tableau dashboard based on the page you are looking at. And finally, I show you how to define the advanced filtering by defining your own filters. If you are interested in learning more about the Tableau Viz LWC, join the Tableau Developer Program. It is currently in beta for members only and it should get released in the next weeks. Thank you for listening and see you soon. Bye bye.